Welcome back to Darkest Dungeon, everybody. The Blood Moon Campaign. Night has fallen on the estate. And we must rest. And recover. From that which has ailed us. Kind of brutal lately, man. I, I was just telling Chad. I'm not feeling 100% confident anymore. <laughs> this has been rough so far. We've already suffered, what, six deaths? Maybe even seven? Five. Okay. That, hey, that actually does make me feel a lot better. I thought it was six. So, that's that's encouraging, but, yeah, rough sledding, man. Is, I gotta, gotta treat this with the proper respect, and I would not mind snagging a musketeer, actually. Sounds great to me. A champion mocks woman. Keen for a new kind of challenge. You got a fresh pick me going as well if you want to be chosen. P-I-C-K-M-E, all one word in the chat. We're gonna draw a couple more names here. I think we've got two to rename, don't we? I think, in fact... Oh, I, th I think I owe some people. I think I might have forgotten from a pick-me from yesterday, unfortunately. If you're there from last time, honor system, I'll, I'll, I'll remember if I see the name, probably. But otherwise, I suppose we'll just have to draw three new names today for uh, Flagellant, Occultist, and Musketeer, it looks like. I'm pretty sure that's all we have to do. Honestly, sometimes I'm not sure whether those are in-game names or Twitch names. Slash user Moobot. Is that a thing? Oh, right. Yeah, that's smart. Look at you, Toasty, knowing the stream and stuff. Uh, so it was going to be then... Let's see. It would have been back then. Oh, uh, no. It doesn't look like I actually drew him. Does Moobot not put that in the message? I thought, he, I thought it did. Huh. Yeah, you just lose the campaign immediately upon hitting 16 deaths. Yeah, I'm not seeing it. That was a good idea, but... Why would it not... Because it, it definitely... Well, hold on, if I... Right, yeah, because if I announce it, then Moobot says it. Yeah, you would think it would be in the message history. But it's not showing, that's weird. Okay, anyway, sorry. Forgot we're in the VOD mode. <laughs> Gotta get back to business. Dapper's gonna join the squad, though, here. I mean, if only we had a Houndmaster to, uh... To be fitting for Dapper Dogman, but... This fits pretty well, too, I suppose. Captain S'mores! Welcome to the squad. We'll have you as our cultist down here. That's one I can pretty quickly label as a Twitch name, at least. Power of the Bonato. Let's see if this one fits in here. Mm -hmm. There it is. Beautiful. Okay. All right. We got a little bit more work to do here, too. I know that much. Just as I feared. Now loosed from their brackish prison, they will spread like locusts across our land. Mm. Those screams and cord trinkets are special, man. It's going to be tempting. Hey, Daniel, welcome. A couple of bosses available here. It might not be a bad idea to try to knock one of those out. I'm going to be able to bring a Kami this time around. And I do have a few more people I'd like to bring up from level zero as well. I wonder if maybe I can do that here. Spend a little more time in the cove. Go for the camper's helmet, which is... I undervalue the wild camping stuff for sure. Like, that, I, I've always undervalued that, but maybe that could be worthwhile. Definitely feels like I want to take this medium dungeon here, though. It's a cleanse in the cove, though. I don't know. Even at this point, it's pretty pretty risky. What if we do something like this, though? It's a pretty strong team. We get the healing in the form of the uh, battlefield bandage from the arbalist, and then I suppose she could get the patch up unlocked as well. We have the Reclaim. We could go with... Oh, right. No, yeah. Reclaim is the heal and the Redeem is the heal as well, right? Yeah, so that's not bad. I think this is pretty functional. That gets us some level zeros. A little bit more experience under their belts. Oh, that's unfortunate, Robin. Um, might you have the notifications turned off? 
There were several notifications this morning as well in the Discord. I'm going to take the, the partial blame for that one for the Pons Polls channel. It's important work, though, damn it. It's for posterity. 50 years down the road, historians will look back on the Discord logs of the Bear Pile server. And thank God that we took the time to document all those opinions. Let's see here. Yeah, I'm pretty happy with their skills. I think she's good to go as well. We get the battlefield bandage here. I'm going to go ahead and unlock the blind fire for her too. And then the patch up. Buckshot I think is probably a little bit better. That'll do. Posperity. Yeah. Pole stare. Oh my goodness. On point today. Oh, you know what? We've got so many crests too. I bet... We could probably, well, with level zeros, I suppose it's not as important. Yeah, let's just go ahead and see if maybe we get those things organically instead of reducing these values. All right, anyway. Dilly dallied enough, I think, for this early on. We have a toy soldier as well. We gotta bring this man at arms out soon, man. I keep leaving him on the bench. Also got the chip tooth for the flagellant. That's nice. Welcome back. YMK. Thank you very much. Give him some bear hugs, please, for the 21 months. Welcome back in. Finally old enough to drink with the pile. Love to see it. Thanks for the support. Uh, this is going to be blight for you, right? And then let's see here. Not a lot of other help going on. I don't think she's got a stun, so it's just a detriment. Yeah, I lost a few of our decent trinkets, unfortunately, in the few deaths we've had up to this point. So hopefully we can find some other good stuff here. Make sure we've got the bandage equipped. Good to go. Call the shot. Not going to be a big factor here. I guess Captivate does have the damage on marked targets. Maybe I could utilize that. We'll see. Okay. Let's get to the cove. You know what? Just bring all the food, man. Let's just start making that common practice. I know it's a little bit extra money, but... It's going to be nice. I know that much. And then a few herbs this time around. we got a couple of shovels here. Let's do it. Good. Good. One anti venom just in case. I think the last time you played DD1, I was also a musketeer, and it ended up being the Bears' best clips compilation for not good reasons. <laughs> oh, oh, no. <laughs> These salt-soaked caverns are teeming with pelagic nightmares. Mm. They must be flushed out. Well, as you heard Wayne say, that, that might be best for this region. Watch your step. Jesus Christ, that is a devastating debuff. Okay. And right into the combat. We're back, baby. All right. I'm, I'm trying to, like... As we've been going here, I feel like I've been getting back into a regular routine in combat where I've recognized now, like, okay, we're back to crowd control mode. We're back to heavy stress focus mode. We're definitely back to kill every stress dealer immediately mode. Without a doubt. Give them no quarter. Anything that deals stress damage has to die before combat begins. That's the rule. That's the second rule directly underneath must use Doggy Treat in first combat with Houndmaster. Ooh, and always bring Flagellant. Also is probably going to have to be a new rule that I follow because that's been going pretty damn well too. Continue the onslaught. Destroy them all. And bop. I'm just going to let move up, pull it, Robin. I don't want to show favorites. Cody, welcome. The Pierce, that's right! The armor-piercing shield breaker is actually fantastic in this region. Their formation is broken. Maintain the offensive. Which is obviously why I chose to bring her. Ghoulish horrors. Brought low and driven into the mud. I mean, we all just assumed that I was aware of that, right? Good. Okay. Same page. A fortune. Waiting to be spent. Now that's not a useless trinket. Okay. There we go. 
More bleed there, not too bad. Pop a torch, and we go. And remember, Bear Quad Leper is best team comp. I'll probably end up doing it at some point, just for the goofs. There's, there's still a very stupid part of my brain that's insistent on making that work. Just to prove all the doubters wrong. And myself. Who's confidently a doubter. Hello, stress dealer. Meet my bullets and arrows. And also this thing. I think they call it a spear? I'm not so sure. Confidence surges as the enemy crumbles. I, I prefer the more lethal variants, to be honest, and those that don't force me to come within arm's reach of a talking fish freak. I guess I don't know that they talk. They just look like they do. They look like they sound like this. Spear Fisher. If I had to guess, I'd put my money there. Third music box? Please and thank you. Triple I initiative in 30 minutes. Oh, shit. I forgot. That's today. Are they doing like a live stream? We might have to pivot. I might have to, <laughs> I might have to edit this VOD so I can pivot and watch that real quick. I totally forgot about that. So this is where we got to start being concerned, certainly. Probably want to go for a Serpent's Way on her. Great is the weapon advantage that on after on that, too. Own. We do have this, and the, com the combination of the patch up and the battlefield bandage is honestly ridiculous. Like, this is going to become so good so fast. It already is. After two of these, she's got the plus 40% healing received for three rounds. Any further heal is going to be outstanding on her. Uh, let's see. I mean, this could mitigate the bleed. It doesn't really seem necessary, though. We'll get at least a little bit of damage out there. Do I just want to Serpent's Way and go for the bandage again? Probably, yeah. That seems, seems best. I'll patch her up a couple more times. It's a really nice defensive option here. I'm really liking what we got going so far. Just the bleed to take him out. Very nice. Go ahead and pop a couple more battlefield bandages here. Up to plus 60%. Quickens. Seem to be getting all that great of an effect, but clearly going to compile pretty well. He can't reclaim himself, right? That would be kind of silly, I guess. So let's do this. And then let's have them maybe start bandaging him. I wonder if that I does. Oh, the uh, rest restoration is impacted by that bonus, too. Of course it is. That's cool. I like that a lot. That's a good synergy as well. All right, same thing to you, buddy. Even if he gets a bigger bleed here, he can probably go for the exsanguinate to bring himself back. That's actually perfect. Very much like that, assuming... Oh, I didn't get exsanguinate, did I? That's right. Yeah, we were... As the fiend a more defensive focus for him. Faint hope we blossoms. actually got the other music box. This is insane. And this is the best one, too. That's outstanding. Let's go. Plus two speed, plus 15% damage. Absolutely thrilled with that. Especially because we're not really using her blight skills all that much, so fine by me. I don't know if he's got his exsanguinate available. I don't think he does. Yeah. For some reason, I didn't want to unlock that one for this run, but oh well. Wealth beyond measure. Awarded to the brave and the foolhardy alike. Hold on. I got to check this website real quick. Nothing's changed. Okay. We just say that an announcement's coming, so we don't know if it's a stream or anything. Might just be like a, a one sheet just describing what they're going to be doing. But I am very, very interested in that. Alright, double grouper. Not double grouper, triple grouper, which could be quadruple grouper, which is, first of all, a great band name. Second of all, much more terrifying. will help us out quite a bit, though, and then we can start getting some bandages on him. Do, do, do. Ooh! That's, uh, that, that gives me uh, an opportunity to do this one. Ooh! Yeah! That's a good heal. I like that. A momentary abatement. 
the rare bale scene. It's a hidden scene in my in my OBS. We pull it out on certain occasions. Alright. Pop. Who's this? Leads nearly there. I think we'll go for a good old fashioned buckshot. No? We don't have that equipped? Could have sworn I did. Alright. Oh well. Oh boy. It's a classic move. Okay, healing up. Still feeling fine. They aren't going to target the back rank, I guess, so I might want to try to kill him first. I'm being real silly about this, though. So he's going to survive that, obviously. We get the block there, thankfully, but... Can we do... Oh, we can do that. There we go. It's better, and then we go ahead and finish him off. Beautiful. Not beautiful. Not quite beautiful. Ah, okay. Actually, never mind. Hold on. That's going to have to be a stall. A time to perform beyond one's limits. I don't like this situation anymore. Fix that real quick. Because that lead won't take, thankfully, which is really nice. Get her a bandage or two. They're spreading the damage like butter on toast. This is what we all wanted, right? This is the these are the reasons we re we requested the return to DD1. Remind yourself that overconfidence and that. is a slow and insidious killer. Thank you, Wayne. Right on cue. All right, how we doing? Very low trap detect chance. That was fortunate. Okay. So far, so good. More torches, too, man. I keep forgetting to do that. I do have to go this way, unfortunately. Just to check for the cleanse. Carelessness will find no clemency in this. You have place. an extra shovel. If it's worth it. Hmm, health stone's not bad, I guess. I could take that. Bomber. Today feels like a two cup of coffee day. I might need to actually get a big docket ready. Right, this is a scary fight. This one I do not like. We'll target her first. We've got a chance at least of not finishing our sentence. Before she decides to act. That'll work. I'm just gonna have to move forward now though. Although I guess she could just blind fire the whole time, assuming he's capable of doing anything back here, which thankfully he is. And a nice big heal there, that's pretty damn good. Let's see if we can finish one of these guys off. Higher likelihood here, I guess. Not quite, okay. Does she have a skill that allows her to move back while shooting? I swear she does. No, I guess not. I don't know what I'm thinking of. Oh well. Hey, Lucky. Nice. This team feels pretty solid. Turns out you don't need to get a dedicated healer if you have three minor healers and a person that is capable of blocking all damage. Not a bad trade-off. Man, Shieldbreaker is pretty sick. I suppose I can make an exception for her snake fights given how goddamn good she's been so far. Have to use her a little more often, man. She's got the bolt. Okay, nice. So maybe I can make that heal a little more effective by the end of it. Yeah, same here, Carl. It's been a good time. Eh, why not? Yeah. Feeling better. Feeling better. I suppose I'm pretty happy we had to reclaim, actually. The ground quakes. Oh, I'm very happy for that too. Thank you. I want to do a little bit of Endure, actually, I'm now realizing. 
as well as we've been prioritizing the stress damage. We want to be able to get rid of some as well. Triumphant pride precipitates a dizzying fall. Let's go ahead and... Oh, no, I didn't get that either. I'm such a silly boy. Okay. I need to remember to do those things. That's huge, though. Wow, good stuff. Okay. Had to take that room, too, so it's a good thing we went that direction. This has been a good start. Shieldbreak is a pay-to-win DLC. <laughs> She's very good, yeah. I'm starting to see why this squad is performing so well. I mean, Flagellant, too, honestly. These are some of the most powerful characters, I think. Well, these two are the same, I guess, but... Alrighty, let's see. The abundant surprise attacks have still been extremely helpful as well. That is making a huge difference. Was anything as strong as Release Flagellant? Probably not. Solo Flag was very much a uh, real possibility. I mean, we've got a really goddamn good one right now, too, man, with the plus 35%. Uh, max HP, chip tooth, and overture box. This guy is feeling good. Love of the dodges too. This has been an excellent start today. This is exactly what I needed. Bleed, please. Thank you. Yeah, let's go ahead and top him off. Why not? Chance at stress healing us. We appreciate that. Oh man, this is great. Bring it on. He loves it. It's his favorite. Slowly, gently. This is how a life is taken. Stop with the optimism, Bear DD can hear you. I know I got a collector on the way after something like that, yeah. God, that, yeah, that's that's jinx. That jinxed it. I'm getting that creep and feeling back. That's for damn sure. I've got the full inventory for it after all. And power. Ah! This expedition at least promises success. I don't need holy water right now. Yeah. Yeah, I might as well just put this on somebody, even though it's not really helping much. Sweet. Probably camping soon, mostly just to clear out some inventory space. So I think I'll stop using torches after this haul and more than likely camp in the next room. I'm shocked by the amount of surprise attacks we've been getting. It feels weird now. Decimated. Feels like something's wrong. Okay. Balance in all things. A devastating blow. Never mind. <laughs> I think I'm cheating again. Oops. I might as well keep going, I guess. In for a penny, cheat for a pound. Collector, no, Shambly's right around the corner. Why not, you know? Put them both in the same fight. Man, that would be... There's probably a mod for that, isn't there? Collector and Shambler in the same encounter. Because a collector without being able to summon its buddies is a lot weaker. But it is still pretty rough. Especially combined with a shambly wambly. The dreaded shambler. Shambler lector. That, that is so. Oh, man. Shannibal lector. It, it's, it, that's not good enough, though. Like, it's, it, there's something like that, but better. It's there. I can't find it, but I'm going to keep mining. I'm going to keep picking away. Maybe that was it. Maybe that is your best. Sham Wayne Gacy. Yeah, refer to previous statement. <laughs> The effort's there. Mmm, pop. There it is. Mmm, pop. Seize this pop, momentum. Pop. Dark Push is on to the dungeon with B-Taf. 
Yes, we do. What's the last umbob cover you heard, huh? I'm gonna go one more room here, so. Let's see. Oh, it's Houndmaster only, that's why. I see. Well, let's definitely get the deeds. I guess I could just use the last two and then. The light. The promise of safety. Yeah, that's fine. That'll work. Another mariner? Mm hmm. Another misfortune. Man, that's a shame to get a one tile hallway with a with an obstacle in it. No scouting this time either. That's a bummer. Should be able to double back here and have an easy enough time of it though. This was the negative quirk removal. Automatophobia could be worth getting rid of, especially given that's a more expensive one. Let's do it. Cannibal Shambler Collector. That's the best I got. Yeah, no, I'm, I'm tapping out now. Hey, no stress damage. Love to see that. Do need to stop blanket fire, though. Ooh, that's a good way to do it. Thanks for the reminder. We're, we are going to play that later. All right, how's the bleed looking? I'm going to do it. He loves it. Bring it on. My favorite. Get rid of your buddies real quick here. Stabberino. Fantastic. Give him the redeem. Oh my. Outstanding. Mark on this guy now. Sniper shot's gonna be devastating. Unforeseen. Devastating for six damage. Way to tee that up, brother. Alright, no worries. I think we just serpent sway here, actually. Just want to keep her healthy. Bleed on the boy. Bleed resistance there as well. Nice. Yeah, yeah actually, I'd consider a lot more marks on these big guys, although I think this might be the first big guy we've seen. Not that shoot. Chad, question, is leaving things out on top of the sink like a toothbrush or shaving razor is problematic? I'm getting heat from the missus. The cursed champion falls. If you ask me, and you seem to be. No, you're asking Chad, actually, but I'm going to pretend you're asking me. Uh, that's, a, that's a mutually shared agreement that, or that, that has to be reflected in the actions of both parties. Welcome. And if she is keeping that countertop clean, you best be doing so too. But if she's not, that's free reign. A handsome reward for a task well performed. That's it. That's if you're asking me. Winded demon mania. None of these are really all that bad, but I guess this is the worst one probably. Warzone Vincent. Get Vincent some bear hugs too, please, for the 107 freaking months on the pile. Sheesh. A spark without kindling. Thank you. It's a goal without hope. Thank you very much for the long term. Appreciate it. Welcome back. We need to spend some time with the survivalist, don't we? We gotta get some actual useful camping skills going here. Wouldn't mind that, though. Actually, we gotta restrain that crossbow, too. That sounds pretty good. So we know we got the snakes coming, so we gotta stay ready for that. Let's see. Matters Embrace could be worthwhile here. Try to get the Blight going on those guys. Speed for the battle. Ooh, Marching Plan, actually. Yeah, give us some extra speed over the snakes. I like that plan. Alright, that's pretty good. I'm going to give him a couple more pieces of food and then call it good. The way is lit. The path is clear. We require only the strength to follow it. The shield breaker is scarred from past trauma. There will be no rest by the fire tonight. All right. Seven flashbacks. Here's the first. Our first encounter with a stealth boy. It's so silent. So eerily quiet. Yum, yum, yum. My favorite. Snake venom. Tasty. 
Gimme. Okay. Apparently they got a lot of dodge. Let me try some marks on these guys. Hmm. Yeah, a lot of DOT there too, alright. See how you like that. There we go. Nice. Dodge. Yeah, these guys are uh they're a tough fight. This is the trade-off with the shield breaker. Good thing we brought some bandages, huh? Let's go ahead and get that reclaim going right away. Nice big heal on the shield breaker. We love it. Mm. Let's see. I kind of like Serpent Sway here. I think I am going to do that. I'll let the two snipers try to take out the snake. Too bad. Jesus. That is a giant blight on him now. Thankfully, we have an anti venom here. Impressive. Big crit. Very nice. All right. Getting one of these guys killed would be huge. Let's see if we can land the impale here. Excellent. A little stress heal for her is unfortunately not going to be enough, but it's nice. Right, we got another reclaim, although it is going to be a lot less effective, obviously, but I think it is probably worthwhile here. Yeah, that's pretty good. Morning rattle. No problem. Probably another blight on him, yep. We're on Q. Oh, nice. That's pretty big. All right, same deal here. Yep, and then... Boom. Oh, does this just end it? The walls close in. The shadows whisper of conspiracy. Better I keep you all in my sight. Oh, apparently not. Okay. Mm -hmm. The vicious agents must be kept on their toes. Don't be freaking all. We're, we're good. We're fine. We're chilling. Uh, that's not worth doing, though. That's a scary situation. I think we just gotta hit that, I guess, and then hopefully we can finish him off with this shot. Nice. Okay. A little bandage here is probably worthwhile. I think he's losing that the healing debuff the next round. But never hidden. Oh boy. Okay. Oh, owie. Don't do that. Okay, that stress is bad, but okay, we got it. Okay. Made it through. These nightmarish creatures can be felled. They can be beaten. The venomous vial for the shield breaker. Cool. Yeah, I'll take that. There's no blight skill chance. In fact, here, you go ahead and have that box and this one. We'll go all in on the blight for her, and we'll start off with some imp impales, probably. Quick draw charm is actually pretty sick for this uh, arbalist as well. There we go. Ninja scales are fun, too. Okay. My goodness. That is scary. Made it through, though. Just a little paranoid. Not a big deal. Hopefully only one more room to go. No more torches either, so... Just kind of pray... Oh, well, there we go, right on cue. Thank you. Just kind of praying that this is the last one here so we can make it out in good shape. Nope. Shit. Alright, well... Certainly cleanse this place, that's for damn sure. Oh, it, it's, it's ended on Death's Door. Okay, right, yeah. Because I remember there being something like that. Finding the stuff is only the first test. Now it must be carried home. Yeah, that was fortunate that we didn't have to deal with that. Ooh, this could be good. Lots of food from this, maybe? No, goodies. That's even better. Another torch there. Nice. I dump the... Uh... Let's go ahead and just use this Aegis scale, I guess. We'll keep this Onyx. 
Get rid of the anti-venom for some gold, and that looks good to me. Nice. Okay. Assuming we make it out of this one, I'm feeling pretty good about this dungeon, dude. What is going on with that? I can't believe how many times we've been, or we've surprised the enemy. Executed with impunity. You're right. I suppose you are still the biggest priority, aren't you? Can't forget that. Knock him back, maybe. Oh, okay. That's pretty good, too, I guess. Although he's probably just going to heal him, isn't he? Oh, all right. I'll take that. There's a lot, though. Yeah, it's getting pretty bad. Thankfully, this is the last one. Ooh, it would be really nice if the Aegis could stop the explosion damage. That might have to be the case here. I don't know if we're going to be able to... Oh, yeah, well... Oh, that'll certainly do it, although... It's a little overkill, I guess. Ooh, the bleed might help us out here. Hopefully the bullet can hit first. Come on, come on. Oh, that's pretty bad. Wastes a block, too, unfortunately. Sidearm, I guess, for that. Ooh, there we go. Okay, that's good. That's really good, especially because it allows us for the bullet on both of these guys. Ooh, I think that forces the ceremonial cut, too. I'll show you a ceremonial cut. It fully failed to pop the impale there, too, but oh well. Utilize the Aegis, at least. We'll redeem. No thank you. Fine with me. Let's do it. A singular strike. Better option anyway. Appreciate that. Success so clearly in view. Or is it merely a trick of the light? All right, well. Great start. At last. Wholesome marine life can flourish. If indeed there is such a thing. You needed that, man. A decent amount of money out of that. A few deeds, right? The paranoia, that's for, for fine. Got through the shield breaker's first snake fight. Terrific. Let me share with you the terrible wonders I have come to know. I love these little flavor bits, man. The Axil's bloodletting was a bit too effective. And the loss of bleed resist. Oh, the Axel's got the curse now, too. Ah, crap. Yeah, it's going to be spreading all around real bad. Let's see here. Sorting by level. We just don't have a couple of zeros that we want to turn into heroes. It is also possibly time to go for our first boss fight. Seems like it might not be a bad idea. I was gonna stop committing people with the curse with non-cursed folks. That would help me out. Ooh, another flagellant. That would be our third one, I wanna say. Let me sort by class real quick. Yeah, I don't know if I need a third one. Wouldn't mind another Plague Doctor, although we'd have two of those as well. I think we might only have one Bounty Hunter, yeah. Let's fix that. The thrill of the hunt. The promise of payment. And that's going to be another pick me if you'd like to be chosen. Let's get a fresh, uh, fresh one going again here, too. P-I-C-K-M-E, all one word. Move will get you into the raffle and we'll draw a new name for our Bounty Hunter that just joined the group. In time, you will know the tragic extent of my failings. To head where? Where are we sending this lot? Look at that, the wounding helmet, huh? Damn, that's tempting. Warren's grants us a cleansing crystal. We get the mercurial salve. Now oh, the ruins, that's not all that great, unfortunately. Although, I guess that does help quite a bit with the courtyard. In fact, yeah, that might, I might have just convinced myself that's worthwhile. I do think prior to going there, it is probably in our best interest to upgrade either the weapons or the armor to rank three. We have so many crests. I wonder if we could just go ahead and trade this like this here. 14 deeds. Yeah, let's do it. Unlock a the armor. sharper sword, a stronger shield. That feels pretty Anything good. Anything to prolong a soldier's life. And guild can go up to rank three as well with another few crests. 
Which feels kind of silly now, but i just do this, I suppose. That ought to do it. Okay. There we go. Good use of the heirlooms. Rank three. Let's think about maybe putting a squad together for this. Hold on. I think we could handle it. I think it's about that time. If we did a keyboarder crusader, double crusader build with a jester and a vestal. That's pretty damn good. We don't need the bleed, though. I'd rather have that. The Inquisition. Ooh. Love a name team. Always love a name team. And we got some music boxes, too, man. I think we're feeling pretty good for this, actually. Now, let's see. We know we've got a guy's built for this, and that's our Ruins Tactician keyboarder. I honestly kind of want to lock in Slugger on him, but I'm not going to do that this time. Oh, good call, Robin. Thank you. Yeah, let's go ahead and draw that bounty hunter now. That's Erd. Welcome to the team, Erd. I'll probably get you out pretty soon here. Very good. Sorry, just let me knock this out. I forgot real quick here. Okay, cool. Good to go. Get these trinkets on these guys. Let's go ahead and invest in your damage a little bit more. Um, I'm going to give him the other double box. Let's get the quick draw charm on the Vestal. No, let's do it on the Plague Doctor so we can do a quick double stun. I think that's going to be really nice. Welcome oh, never mind. She's going to get the double blight things. Yeah, that's going to be better for her. And then let's do stun skill chance for you. Cast troop! Oh, that's exciting. Okay, you know what? Hold on. That's going to be a moment. Happy 100 months, KS. Please get him a whole bunch of bear hugs here. We, we got to do this live. Here we go. For a little while, I've been waiting for somebody to be our first member of the Papyrus. As we've got our chalkboard up there. But now we got to start filling in that Papyrus sheet, right? We got another section ready to go. If I can remember where I saved that. Uh-oh. Maybe I shouldn't do this live. <laughs> Maybe I need to find this sheet of papyrus Photoshop document first. Okay, tell you what. Here's what we'll do for now. For the time being, our temporary fix. We'll just create a little text thing here that says... KS Troop. There we go. Nice and big. Right there. Perfect. That's where it needs to be, right? That's ideal. But that's not the right font. It's got to be this one. Hold on. I think I remember which one it is. That one right there. That looks right. Perfect. And then resize. And then Oh, you're going to need a little black border on there, though, aren't you? It's so small. It's so itty-bitty. Oh, God. I'm going to have to rethink this. <laughs> Just a widow guy. Just a widow baby guy. Outline. Size 5. Size 7. Select color. 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0. And then... It's still so bad. How do I fix this? It's got to be bold face. Right? Certainly. And then a little bigger. God, it's terrible. Just make the whole... Nah, that's way worse. What have I done? Soiled it. Oh, God. It just looks like a big smudge now. There, please. Okay, tell you what. What if you just make the whole thing black? There you go. Do that. <laughs> it's literally just a smudge. It's just a big smudge. Look at it. Look at look at my disaster. I'll fix this for you later, okay? I'll do a proper one. I'll get it on the papyrus because you deserve it for the support. But that's it for now.
And then we get to laugh at that again when I forget to remove it at the end of the broadcast. Okay, cool. Off we go. Double check on the skills here. Hold on. Got that. Got that. Do I want to give you the heal? Probably. No, you're going to stun stuff. You might even zealous, actually. Yeah, let's... You know what? You don't even need any heals. We got it covered. We got it handled, brother. We are going to unlock your Holy Lance, though, just in case. And also level up these skills. That's right. Yeah, we just spent all that money on that. We might as well. Or those heirlooms, rather. Sword by activity. Get these guys in here. Stunning blow. Actually, it's a nice upgrade from that. Get your Holy Lance unlocked. Let's make sure I'm not spending too recklessly here because these are going to be pretty expensive upgrades. Dazzling light. Let's see. You guys are good. Smite could be worth it. Oh, yeah. The bonus damage against Unholy definitely makes Smite worth it here. And then let's make sure they get the Blacksmith upgrades as well, which honestly I could stand to make cheaper here. Can I... Let's go for some deeds and crests out of this, I suppose. Right? Yeah. I think so. Get six of those guys, and then turn some portraits into deeds here. And then... Oh, God. This is... This is sketchy. Fan the flames. Mold the metal. We are raising an army. Just to save a little bit of money, I think I better go ahead and sell something, too. Hold on, let's... Eh, the cursed incense. I don't think I need that. It's a good 1500 That'll work. God, it's so expensive. So, so expensive. Oh, I hate it. Oh, I hate it. Get rid of you? Yeah, okay. We need provisions, right? Oh, boy, I hope we win this. <laughs> oh, no. Here you go, man. Oops. God damn it. All right. That'll have to do. My goodness. Let's go kill a goddamn necromancer, huh? Conservative here. Holy cow. I don't think I. Oh, right, yeah, that's free. Okay, we don't need another holy water. Jeez, dude. Yeah, we gotta bring the blood, too. Oh my god, this is all our money. Oh no. Mastery over life and death was chief among my early pursuits. I began in humility, but my ambition was limitless. Who could have divined the prophetic import of something as unremarkable as a twitch in the leg of a dead rat? I know for me it's only 10 a.m., but I'm going to pour one out for you and wishing for good runs. I might need it, brother. It's 5 o'clock somewhere, and it's time to meet my maker, apparently. A devil walks these halls. Only the mad or the desperate go in search of him. So we remember, the boss is always in the furthest room away from your starting point. Meaning he's right there. And that's where we're going. Got a pretty damn good team for this, certainly. That's comforting, at least. Lacking a little bit in the stress healing, I guess. We do have a little bit coming from the Crusaders, but not as much as I'd like. I'm getting Torchlight, though. That's really good, actually. Lack of torches. That'll be really helpful. That helps, too. There we go. Fairly high likelihood now, actually, to be able to just finish her off before the next big stress hit. Got him stunned already. Let's... Consider doing some early stress healing, actually. Shit, yeah, why not? Compassion is a rarity in the fever pitch of Seems battle. like a golden opportunity. And then we got an 11 to 21 decent chance to kill here. But their stun resistance is low as well. And that's a decent amount of damage, too. Could even be a zealous opportunity. 
I just miss those those yellow crowns, man. They make me very happy. You just fill me with hope to see their lack of actions. There'll probably be another stun, although I guess I could just go for this too. More torch light after all. Another inspiring cry coming up. We got the blight taking the madman out as well. Let's go for the full torch light from the bulwark. The match is struck. A blazing star is born. This is outstanding Great is the weapon that cuts on its own not only is this good this, this this is starting to feel like old times this is starting to fill me with the kind of confidence that i never should have had in the first place but i'll i'll find it again this team kicks ass continue the onslaught destroy them all. Brother, we're getting into this necromancer fight at zero stress. That's the new objective. Zero stress, full HP. The squad ain't fucking around. That's exactly what I'm talking about. They know. They know what's up. Crushing it. Another stun. Full torch. Why not? Confidence surges as the enemy crumbles. Two holy waters? Ooh! Thank you. Don't mind if I do. Love a scout as well. I definitely should have brought two shovels. Even the cold stone seems bent on preventing passage. Although I absolutely could not have afforded that, so never mind. I'm going to give myself a pass there. What do you think the most satisfying thing is in DD1? Full crit divine comfort. Oh, you had the answer, and you might be right, too, actually. Yeah, that's a pretty likely candidate. That or uh, uh, Cry Havoc full stress heal. I think that might be a little bit more just because it's a little less likely. But popping three stress healed on each party member off the dog howl is, is pretty satisfying. Reducing, my friends. Ah, oh, okay, okay. It's too bad I'm unhittable. Plus eight dodge, man. Let's go. Whoops! Ah. Still though, very little effect. Feeling good. Blight is gonna be enough for this guy. Let's go ahead and get him started. Triple digit finale crit. We're gonna be getting into the triple digits pretty soon here, aren't we? That's right, yeah. Slowly, gently. Well, this is how a life is taken. Not very frequently, but every now and then I'm sure we'll pull one off. That's gonna be pretty fun. Press this advantage. Give them no quarter. That was fully unnecessary, but it'd give, give us a little stress heal, I guess. The crit point blank shot. Yeah, this leopard or leopard at some point is gonna be going off for us here likely too. I seem to remember some Hellions actually dealing some really big damage as well. As the light gains purchase, spirits are lifted mm -hmm. and purpose is made clear. Oh, this just feels so good. The blood pumps. The so good. Obey. I'm so happy with this. Uh-huh, uh-huh, uh-huh. Pop them off. A little bit more. That's going to be for you. Oh, baby. The oh, baby. Of war can be healed. Wow. All I right. Welcome back. Brutally odd. Success so clearly in view. Welcome on back. Or is it merely a trick of the light? Thank you very much for the bear hugs for him. Welcome back to the pile for 38 months. Appreciate it. 62 mo 62 more months and you can join KS Troop on the smudge screen. Right there. You can be like him. Something to shoot for. Alright. Ah, oh, I can't use a shovel on that. Do I have a key though? I might as well. Sweet. Sports light's feeling pretty good. Okay, so far so good here. 
Scout, please? Nope. Okay. Of course, ideally, we're going to be able to camp right before... Doesn't this work? No. Okay. Well. Ooh. Oh, well. We're going to go ahead and say that me putting the anti-venom in there... Ambushed by foul invention. ...prohibited that blight. Well played, Bear. That was herbs, right? Yeah, I remember that. I thought it also interacted with venom for some reason, though. When's triple I? I believe it's now. Hold on. Look into that real quick. Oh, it's a digital showcase for triple I games coming April 10th. So the announcement was to look forward to a future date. Okay, that's all it is. Cool, didn't miss anything. That's still exciting though. So we'll definitely stream that. We'll live stream the uh, Triple I showcase when it happens. That'll be fun. Mm -hmm. Oh, this is where we get to see the big numbers. He's gonna be smacking these fools. The slow death. Mm -hmm. Unforeseen. Unforgiving. All right, not too bad. Not too bad, not too bad. A little stun there. Second blight from the plague doctor ought to do it in the back. The way is lit. The path is clear. We require only the strength to follow it. Kind of looks like an E3 for indie games. I love that. I think there's absolutely a space for that. As the fiend falls, a faint hope blossoms. Especially now that E3 has become basically irrelevant. This expedition at least promises success. I could sell that, I guess. Hang on to it for now. Ooh, oh, no, I don't have a key. Ah, I used it on the damn cabinet. Hopefully I can find another one. That's a nice find, though. It's going to be difficult to get that in the inventory at the moment anyway. Yeah, let's try one. Oh, cool. Books aren't terrible after all. Oh, no. I'm, like, out of food, too. Shit, I didn't even realize that. Mm. <laughs> Wait. No. Yeah, calm down. Oh, wow. Well, again, that doesn't really matter. I wish it had a positive effect, but that's fine. Yeah, I usually just ignore the bookshelves. I'm not really sure why. I think I'm just I'm feeling pretty good about myself, so I feel like I can take any risk at this point. Hubaris, yes, exactly. I don't prefer either one, so they're both good. I refute the need to state my allegiance for one or the other. Temptation grows! Oh, I was gonna call it too, man. That dude's been dodging everything. I'm loving it. Another abomination cleansed from our lands. And pop. Oh, alright. Yeah, it might just give me another stress heal, I guess. Their formation is broken. Maintain the offensive. Oh my god, stress healed herself for 11. Thank you. Okay. A bunch of money. Be wary. Triumphant pride precipitates a dizzying fall. All right. So what I think we'll do... Oh, Jesus. No. No, go away. We don't, we don't want you here right now. This isn't okay. Oh, fuck. Um, yeah, this is bad. <laughs> it's okay. Thank you for not cursing me immediately, but I feel like it's only a matter of time here unless we can get extremely lucky, which is so far proving to be the case. Okay. Okay. Yeah. That all works out splendidly, thank you. 
That'll do. Another blight. They're both dead. Wow. Cool. Thank you. Free blood. Seize this momentum. Push on to the task's end. Okay, so we didn't find a key. We do have a little bit more of this hallway to scout, and I think what I'm going to do is just let the torchlight burn all the way down so we can use the campfire to restore it. And then we'll uh, just double back to the secret room at the very end of the fight, or at the very end of the dungeon. For the off chance of finding another key. I mean, I came clean. Clearly, I've got the cheats on today. All right, there we go. There we go. Another double blight will do it. Let's go for this little bit of stress healing here. I guess we do have the camp coming up, although it's only half food, so I don't necessarily want to bank on that. I don't think I, ne I, don't think I need to Masterfully executed. go for the torchlight here either, especially because she's probably going to pop another stun if she gets the chance. Double blight doesn't in the back there. I got the stun for this round. I think I could probably go ahead and stress heal again, actually. Especially if it's a crit. Thank you. And uh, you just judge me, don't you? Yeah, good stuff. Clean. Clean, clean, clean. No need for the bulwark. Send it. Plague Doctor's blight is exceptionally strong in this game, yeah. Victory. Perhaps the turning point. Absolutely. Okay. Pleading that we don't get another hunger trigger here. I think we just did, though. Oh, it's a trap. Okay, thank goodness. That way we'll be able to at least eat half food. So we're going to go all the way through here and then back up. Hopefully get a key. Nope. A fortune. Damn. Waiting to be spent. Hmm. I want to keep the bandages out. Oh, this is really unfortunate. I guess I just dump 100 gold. Yeah, I don't really need that. Okay. Backing it up here. Oh, we need a back it up emote. That's what we need is a new bear animated emote. Backing up. Just reverse the bear roll, I guess, right? Circle in the dark. The battle may yet be won. I'm looking to prevent the ambush if we can. I don't know if anybody has that option, unfortunately. Holy cow, this could be crazy. Pray to reduce stress, especially on the religious guys. Chant to reduce stress. Wait, who has the box? Arya box, so you want it. So we can get even further reduced stress for you. And then zealous speech. These guys now have, well, this guy has minus 35% stress received. And then minus 15% for these two. We got protection up front. There we go, there we go, there we go. Newest mutant. A renewal. Welcome back. Welcome back. Thank you for the prime. Thank you for the bear hugs form, appreciate it. Thank you very much for the support. In radiance, may we find victory. All right, it's time. torch for the very end of this hallway as well so we can top it off to 100 before the fight here the light the promise of safety holy water for everybody let's do it towering fierce terrible nightmare made material not gonna lie I think we're about to kick this shit out of this guy but I'm down. It's gonna feel good. Mortality clarified in a single strike. Here's his first scaly boy. The blight started on him here real quick. Or the accuracy as well is really nice. Quick little slash, and then you know what? I'm just gonna ignore the skeletons completely. They, they might as well not even exist. All in on the big guy. On the big guy. Although I suppose they are going to stop me from targeting him pretty pretty quickly by occupying the front slot, so I might not have a choice, I guess. It's done again. There we go, dude. 
All right, let's see here. Back to the pit. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. That'll do. One more blight for you, buddy. There's your stun. Oh, he's such a good boy. You, you are so good, aren't you? Isn't this a fun fight with Bear? It's not. You don't like getting beat up? Oh, buddy. I didn't know. I'm sorry. Here, I'll, I'll make it quick. I'll make it fast. Doesn't have to last much longer. Sorry for bullying you. I won't do it again. Unless you come back as a stronger form of yourself later on in the campaign. And then happen to do that a second time. In which case, I'll have to teach you a lesson. But just the once for now, okay? Even reanimated bones right, can cool. fall. Even the dead can die again. Thanks, bud. See you next time. I told you, man. We put together the right team for this. That is for damn sure. This was the squad. We got the job done. We'll get the full value out of this secret room, obviously, but at least you still get another trapsahedron and certainly need that. You're hurting for funds right now. Hell yeah. Oh. Well, better than nothing. Sweet. Got ourselves a mercurial cell for the next courtyard run. A whole bunch of crests again. Level threes. A skilled gambler and a fair weather fighter. Nice. Knock that out. They meet in secret, that no. men may know the horrifying depths of their inquiries. Huh. Well, that's cool and all, but I don't really need more occultists, but thanks anyway. All right. What's next? The Inquisition's on the bench for now. Maybe the Swine Prince needs a, needs a round. I'm feeling good enough about that, too. Probably got some folks ready for action here. Get a little bleeding done. Bleed team? Yeah, maybe. A little flagellant, a little uh, arbalist, maybe, or an occultist, perhaps. Yeah, yeah. That could be good. Can increase the lower protection. This seems like fun. Can we fight the fanatic? That's not up to me, unfortunately. I'm sure it'll happen eventually, though. <laughs> I feel like there's something I'm forgetting with this fight. That's it. That's it, Wumpus. The Arbalist to clear the mark with the Rallying Flare. That's right. And the thing that essentially makes this fight a cakewalk. Yeah, that's worth. It's a good team, too. Covers our bases. A little stress healing in there. I like it. Still only 10,000 gold, though. Yikes. And some money, man. I think we'll do the Swine Prince, and then we'll probably do another Antiquarian run just to get a little bit more cash in our pockets. Let's go ahead and get this set up for now, though. Leave the guild with y'all. Make sure we got the right skills here. He does have the Exsanguinate. He's got his Endure as well. I think he upgraded the Hound's Rush and the Cry Havoc. The Stun upgrade is good. That's all good. I'm going to unlock Hound's Harry for him as well, actually, and give that, go ahead and give that up to level two. I think I'll swap off the self-heal for now until I actually need it. And then, let's see here. Jester for the extra bleed. A little bit more stress healing done. 
More stress heal from the Endure. That's a huge upgrade. God, this stuff is expensive. Every damn run now, we're going to be spending the entirety of our money. We can't even get them up to level three. Oh, boy. That's a big upgrade, too, man. I do have two disease charms I could sell, I guess. And then, stun stone's not great. Debuff charm, yeah, I don't need that. Ugh, hate it. Hate it, hate it, hate it. I'm gonna sell a camper's helmet. I know I just said, I just said I undervalued it, but I think I value it a lot more as 1,500 gold right now. All right, get those skills sorted. Looking good, looking good. Do I want anything else here? Probably not, maybe Battle Ballad. I don't think I wanna be using Dirk's tab, actually. Yeah, let's go ahead and get that too. And then level it up to level three, maybe. Yeah, it's probably worth it. Ah, I gotta sell more shit. Ooh, geez. Oh, I can't sell the venomous vial. That's interesting. Let me get rid of the double-edged pendant. Okay. Oh my god, man. Oh boy. Okay. This is tough. Yeah, we need an anti Q run desperately. I'm pretty sure that's on the docket after this. But I think we can take on the Swine Prince with this team pretty effectively. Let's get them set up with their trinkets here. Kind of give you the cudgel weight. Stun Stone. Get the Crimson Curse trinket on him. Extra HP, more damage back here. I'll go for the quick draw on you as well, and then lead skill chance. That'll do. That'll do. Oh boy. Yet again, a lot of pressure on this. going to require some anti-venom. All right. Single key. Two shovels just in case this time. And a little more food. God dang. Sell the Blightstone too, I guess. A little more food here. Okay. 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 Oh, boy. The ways and rituals uh, of blood sacrifice are difficult to master. Those from beyond require a physical vessel if they are to make the crossing into our reality. The timing of the chance is imperative. Without the proper utterances at precise intervals, the process can fail spectacularly. Seems DD2 has been picked as game of the year in Canada? Like the government gave them the award? A testament to my failures. It must be destroyed. Does the government of Canada have its own game awards? I want to watch. That's dope, though. So it's got to be boom, 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 boom. One, two, three, four. Because this is one, two, three. Must be right there. Okay. I'm going to take the easiest possible route. Not use bandages there. Sweet. A fortune. Ooh. Waiting to be spent. That's really good. Four extra food right away. Almost certainly gonna be able to. Man, we might be able to feast at the camp, actually. That'd be outstanding. And this is slightly better. Also gives us some treasure, which is nice. This one, I think, is either a positive or a negative quirk. Ooh, that's helpful immediately, isn't it? Mind that such missteps nice. are the exception, and not the rule. It's almost certainly Wilbur's a beast. And we got a lot of beasts in here, too. Excellent. This 
Oh, yeah. There we go. We're cooking. Inspiration and improvement. Still targeting our stress dealer here. I did forget my rule right away of using the dog treat, but I do think it's best to keep the dog treats for the boss fight in this in this circumstance. The slow death. Unforeseen. Unforgiving. It would be really nice to have both of those. Oh, you got to go pretty quick that time. Oh, okay. Stress at least. Honestly, that's probably not even going to really be a factor. Man, that upgraded when door is crazy good. Take some free stress heals here. I go for another blackjack up front. Nice dodge. Hell yeah. And you've got the bola, don't you? Yeah, nice. Hit it. Continue the onslaught. Destroy them. Ooh, she is craving though. I wonder if I could stall that for a little longer to guarantee that we're able to keep her curse benefit through the boss fight. Because we can wait until wasting, right? I think there's a wasting level after that. Press this advantage. Give them no quarter. Just stall for a little bit. Mm hmm. Glittering gold, trinkets and baubles, paid for in blood. All right. Can you explain the blackjack skill in simple terms? Club go bonk. Make boy go ow. Still very tempted to use a campfire on this thing. I'm also getting pretty far ahead of myself. Let's kill these guys first, huh? That'll do it. Not quite, but nearly. Oh, we have Hound's Harry. Let's go. That'll do it. Two turn timer there as well. Golly! is the weapon that cuts on its own. Can you explain it like you're talking to your dog? You want go bonk with club? You take club go bonk? Oh, there's a good boy. Exposed to a killing blow. But then you have to type a bear chops if I do that. A death by inches. Oh, I forgot to equip battle ballad. Let's fix that. Bonk! You don't go boy go bonking! You like that bonk, don't you, bud? Can you explain it like you're a football manager? Well, you see, we, uh... We got the... We got the club. And, uh, what you wanna... What you're gonna wanna do with that is you're gonna wanna bonk with it. A faint hope blossoms. And that way the boy gets bonked. And that's that's honestly that's been the drive of this club for a long time now. We're just trying to get boys bonked around here. Their formation is broken. Maintain the offensive. As victories mount, so too will resistance. Now we'll do a uh, football team captain trying to pump up, pump up his squad before they go out on the pitch. All right, boys, we're going to go out there. We're going to take these clubs and we're going to box some heads in. We're going to box some heads in, aren't we, boys? Yeah, yeah. We're going to go out there. We're going to show these fellas we mean business by giving them the bonk. Yes, sir. Let's go. Let's go. And then we all run out on the field. Can you do it like a nature video? Here we see the boy in their natural habitat. Not at all expecting to be bombed. Little does he realize. Uh, renewal. Welcome back. There's a bonking waiting for him. Just around the corner. Clonus! Thank you for three months of the pile. Welcome on back in. Bear hugs, please, for him. Subbing to encourage bonking. Appreciate it. Oh, no. That's not good. 
All right, give him the blood. Give him the blood. Camping out. Huddled together, furtive and vulnerable. Rats in a maze. Ah, yeah, I could call Angus. Thank you. I'm gonna do that after the camp. Now explain it like Christopher Walken. You take the club. You go bonking with it. You got. You get him the bonk. I can't do a good walking. I did my best. Uh, let's see. What do you got? The hounds watch. That's a good call. Let's take the minus twenty stress for him. Get rid of that. Tiger's eye is probably worth. And that's good. Sweet. In radiance, may we find victory. Hey, see you. How you doing? All right. That's that, I guess. I feel like we got through this one way quicker than the other one. Probably because we did. Makes a lot of sense. The light, the promise of safety. What if we lose to the swine prince? It's a good thing we're not gonna. Especially after I remember to equip the battle battle. I don't think we need to worry about that. It is a travesty. A blundering mountain of hatred. Bear, can you beat this in the next rage. two minutes? I gotta get ready for work then. Start the clock. Go, go, go. Bear lean. Speed run. I immediately forgot to remove the mark, but that's okay. Oh, right. Yeah, don't hit Wilbur also is a thing. Okay, that's good to remember. Stun time? Try it. Try it, try it, try it. Okay, good. All right, you're, you're going on timeout for a minute. So you learn to stop tagging me in every message and tell me what to do, please. Thank you. Speed running here. I don't got time for that. Lead him out. Oh, I don't even have rallying flare clips. Yeah, whatever. Who needs it? This is easy mode. The ground quakes. We're speed running. Cleared his own mark. Ooh, nice crit. Okay, okay. I see you. Big boy's got some moves. Yeah, that works. This is just... <laughs> some people, man. <laughs> Stop it. Stop, stop it. Stop giving me instructions. It, this is our 45th darkest dungeon campaign, y'all. How many times have you have heard me yell at chat? Stop telling me what to do. I know what to do. I've played the game. Even if I make a mistake, just let it happen. For the love of God. It's absurd. Dazed, reeling, about to break. Why do you think you need to tell me what the instructions are? Okay, okay, calm down. We're fine. Everything's fine. The thing is even more horrible in death. Liquefaction cannot oh come goodness. soon enough. See, it worked. You know, it, it, it worked out okay, didn't it? I figured it out. Remind yourself that overconfidence is a slow and insidious killer. Golly. Okay. Get out of here. There we go. GG. Time? Yeah, did we make it? Did I, did I manage to speedrun the boss while also yelling at chat? Because that's a new category. We have to establish, that's number one of one of that speed run. All right, later on, hey. Hey, that's a great trinket too. I didn't even really re like recognize the value in that. Pretty damn good flagellant one there. An additional damage above 85 stress is a pretty cool uh, additional perk. Yelling percent, yeah. <laughs> the degeneracy of the hamlet is nothing, I fear, when compared to the condition of surrounding acres. I'm sorry, I'm sorry for the outburst. It's just, it, it's not a result of one time. Those, those only happen when it's just been over and over and over. I gotta, you gotta put it to an end when you can. 
right. Now we need an anti-Q run. Now we need to make some cash. That's very clear. And a short run would be fine for that? These aren't great options, though. That's what's unfortunate here. Yeah, there's not really... Especially with all these being skirmishes. Hmm. I'm doing good on stress. I mean, we can just bring out some level zeros, I guess. Doesn't really matter what we do at that point, but... I don't know if we've got a good team for the cove, either. Let's maybe just hit this wield. Are there any good trinkets, maybe? Not really. Rocket sensor's not bad. Ah, oh, Witch's Vial's actually not bad, either. Yeah, you know what? We'll go for that. We'll go for the... the short wield here. Yeah, I know. I don't mind the dog treat tease. That, that's all tongue-in-cheek. I know that much. It's just when people are like, use this skill in this moment, or like, you know, you, you get it. Anyway, enough of that. Um, let's go for those level zeros here. Swap y'all lot in. The burden of suffering cannot be shared. We know that much. That has become clear. That's a good team. Yeah, that's a great team, actually. It's a solid, rock-solid team. Let's give them the right skills here, though. Mm hmm. Athletic sanguinates. Uppercut for the front rank boy. You need. Yeah, I think you're good, actually. Yeah, and then Annie Q's got all her skills unlocked, too. I could probably go ahead and level up her heal and stab, probably. Yeah. Oh, the light, too, right? There we go. That's nice. Welcome back. Smiley! Thank you very much for the prime. The seven months on the pile. Welcome back in. Bear House Forum, please. Appreciate it. Mm hmm, mm hmm, mm hmm. Oh, does this not. Oh, right, it's the. Yeah, okay. Level enough that way. There we go. And I think I am going to go with this build this time, which means we probably go ahead and level up Exsanguine as well. And I spent all my money again. Yay! Eh, not really worth. Okay, okay. Here we go. Trinket time. Sort this out. And then, ba boom, ba boom. Do I want to use that? I think so. Yeah, I like that well enough, especially considering we can help him out with this as well. Let's go ahead and give him the speed and damage too. You can take less stress. Let's have you be the first to act here, and then, you know what? Yeah, disease resist, sure. A little dodge back there too, cool. Hey, Tim. Welcome. Good to have you. Evasive, natural, and stout. Damn, she's got some nice quirks. Go pawn. Okay. Feeling good? Looking good? Ready to go? Seems good. Swap this. Hold up. And, yep. There we go. And send. This is short dungeon. Full stack of 12 is probably fine. We're going to the wheels. So let's go ahead and take a couple of anti-venom. Two keys just in case. I think we're good. Laudanum does not interact with any curios, question mark? I don't think. Corruption has soaked the soil, sapping all good life from these groves. Two shovels is Let us burn out this evil. <laughs> I saw that and I was like, ah, then we'll probably be fine. And then immediately punished. Oh no. Pull is definitely Precision and power. more effective on these guys. Although I say that, but their escape cloud is debatably worse than their other move. I might even prefer them in the back ranks, especially with the abyssal art artillery here. Full swap in our strategy for this rod, which is very fun. And obviously, the Anna Q usually creates that situation on her own. That mob has a very phallic-shaped head. Yeah, that's impossible to argue. Dude, dude, dude's got a dick for a head. I agree. And are those his boys behind him? 
Ah, oh, yeah. No, I don't want him to be, but you're right. Now that you've called it so clearly to my attention. I, I can't have any other interpretation, and every instance of this uh, set of mobs is going to remind me of that now. A death by inches. That's just become a, a permanent facet of the campaign. All right. Wish we could get dog treats for the flagellant. Or the abomination, right? Press this advantage. Give them no quarter. He's a good boy. He deserves treats, too. All right. Weedle do. Oh, the Blight's only for one. Okay, I guess that's not as bad. That's manageable. Can we heal here? Probably not. The Abomination literally has that dog in him. Plus two. Thank you. Okay, there we go. Heal him up. Brilliant. So far, so good. A devastating blow. Okay, remember to use the antiquarian to interact with the curios. The slow death, unforeseen, unforgiving. Don't forget the entire point of bringing her around. You make some money. Ghoulish horrors, brought low and driven into the mud. Gimme, gimme, gimme. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Now we're talking. Now we're getting cooking. The way is lit. The path is clear. Convenient. We require only the strength to follow it. Mm -hmm. We're chosen. What does the Q and Annie Q stand for? Uh, quietly carrying the run. Or Quiznos. Yeah, that's acceptable too. Do it. Nice. There we go. There we go. Great is the weapon that cuts on its own. She's out, she's out here dealing some damage, man. As is he. Oh, okay. Very glad we have this. Holy Christ. Right back at you, fella. More blight. Ooh, could she? Could she? On with the kill. Slowly. Very nice. Gently. This is how a life is taken. Captain S'more is crushing it with the heels so far, too. Look at this squad. Ready to go. Crushing it. Oh my. Bird, holy cow. Came to play. A trifling victory, but a victory nonetheless. Oh, cool. Apparently that gets rid of quirks. That's good. Right back to it. Mm -hmm. Collector? Basically a collector, same thing. Another one falls. This is absurd. I'm actually cheap today. I, did something happened. Something changed. Another abomination cleansed from our lands. Get ridiculous at this point. <laughs> <laughs> Was there a fight, or did we just As accidentally step on mount, some maggots? So too will resistance. And I'm pretty sure it was the latter. I did say the other day the collector was four maggots in a trench coat. Consistency. Thy name is Bear. Apparently. Apparently. Well, that's just like a full different word. It actually means something. Ambushed by foul invention. I'm gonna claim it anyway. Get rid of this garbage. Get out of here. I don't wanna hold it temporarily. Uh, no bandages, unfortunately. 
torch there. This is probably uh, one of the worst squads we're going to see in this place. Still not that bad. Definitely going for artillery first. Bleed will do it. Outstanding. The blight chance not fantastic, so let's go ahead and just get a little damage up front, I guess. Works for me. Unnerved. Unbalanced. Not like that, though. That's not great. Alright, no crit at least. Okay. As the fiend falls, a faint hope blossoms. No worries. Probably needs a heal there, though. In fact, let's. Well, no, that's a waste. Of it. Missed the Jester's Harvest right now. That'd be. Prime target. Oh, boy. Oh, he's got the. He's got the Perfectionist Quirk here. Yeah, and the Yips. Wow, that's a terrible combination, dude. We gotta fix that. That is not good at all. Oh, boy. Come on now. Why? No dog in this phallic lineup. We got the double dicks, though. And they are being double dicks about it. Jeez. Now, the true test. Hold fast or expire. I really cannot afford to lose Erd here. Oh, come on now. Be kind. I do have her fortifying vapors. That's nice. I, think I should go ahead and. Compassion is a rarity. Ooh, in the boy. Okay. Okay. Do we have? I don't think I have his redeem unlocked. Ooh, that'll help though. Nice. At the very precipice of oblivion. We have Eternity's Collar here. We have Exsanguinate as well. There we go. Ooh, now we're back. Fixed it up. No sweat. How about a heal for 13? <laughs> Never change, buddy. A decisive pummeling. All right. Stun time. Yikes. Struggling this time, man. Continue the onslaught. Destroy them all. My favorite are the crit zeros. Right, yeah. So he's got the double zeros. Now we got a crit for zero and we get the, the healing turkey. Alright. That's boring. Thank you. Let's endure real quick. Little transfer there. And want to heal a little bit more, probably. Yeah. A hey, normal welcome. Yeah, I'll take what we can get. Stun there is not impossible, but not likely either. No bleed. Tanky, tanky boy. All right, made up for it. A couple pretty good ones at the end there. No more bleed resist too, thankfully. Terrific. Nearly through. Confidence surges as the enemy crumbles. Oh, and there's some money. There's even more Lots money. Reward for a task well performed. Sweet. I think we have herbs for this too. Nice. If Hell only yeah. treasure could staunch the flow of otherworldly corruption. Tons of spare food here. I think we go ahead and top everybody off as we can, and then the match torch is struck. time. A blazing star is born. There we go. All right, now to prevent this. I wonder if we can get another music box. I suppose now that we have all three, that's probably not going to happen. I don't think you can get duplicates, can you? Oh, really? Why don't I think you couldn't do that from there? That's a shame. Okay. Stab might actually be able to finish her off, although the anti-Q is 
pretty slow. This is a nice side effect of doing that, at least, though. These guys with the harmless swipes are going to be a lot less concerning. There's another stress hit. Not too bad. Lowers our towards light a little bit more, though, unfortunately. Let's do this to guarantee that we're going to get the harmless swipes from these guys, or try to, anyway. Madman's dead to DOT. Yeah, I got the horror coming in on here. That's all right, though. Hopefully, you can get a little bit less from that. Jesus, this freaking Yips perfectionist situation, man. The formation is broken. Maintain the offensive. I got to take this dude into the sanitarium pronto. That is a terrible combination of quirks. That's nice, at least, but yeah, it might be a little too late here. Let's at least do that to stop it for now. So we don't have a camp to try to figure this out either. Let's see. Let's just go ahead and whack him. And no need to heal, I suppose. We'll just go for the stab there. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Oh, that's unfortunate timing. Damn. We got another harmless. Oh, well. Ah, no! Okay, didn't add to the bounty hunter, thankfully, there. We're still avoiding it for now. I would like to avoid the Rapturous as well, although I guess it doesn't matter too much. Saying they works. That is not quite it, though. All right, please don't miss. I hate it. Bird, you're in trouble. Frustration and fury. You are in trouble. In God damn it. All right. Bird is blind. That's my new favorite Netflix show. No anti-venom, but let's take a gamble anyway. Unfortunate. The torchlight again. Very close to the end here, though. Even black as pitch, obviously not ideal. Finding the stuff is only the first test. Now it must be carried home. We got three. Or sorry, we have three keys, and I didn't really have any use for them. Quadruple dog. Oh boy. Okay. Here we go. To a killing blow. There it is. Yeah, the torchlight's good for loot. It's bad if I want to stay alive, but it does mean more money. So hopefully we can be rewarded here. Oh my goodness, dude. Alright, those bleeds are enough back there. Nice dodge on the anti Q. Let's go ahead and get a little stab in. Both dead to DOT. Actually makes us pretty good for an acid rain here. 61 versus 56. I guess that's slightly better. Additional damage taken as well. Uh, I guess they act first. Yeah, that's gonna mean it's from ranks for them. That's probably fine though. Mm -hmm. That'll do it. All right. End of the day, not too bad, I guess. Obliterated. I'm stressed out, but we can fix it. We got a lot of money out of it, I think. Hey, that'll help. Not done yet either, potentially. Okay. Remind yourself that overconfidence is a slow and insidious killer. Oh, all right, that'll make my choice for me. Yeah, this says no. Says, nah, ah, uh, ah, uh, time to go, bear. Driving out corruption is an endless battle, but one that must be fought. 13 grand. All right, that'll do. That feels better. Fairweather fighter balanced Captain S'mores. All right, let's take that bounty under the goddamn sanitarium, dude. Once, our Hi! state was the envy of this land. Oh, great. Our friends here. Love him. Yeah, let's get rid of the uh, perfectionist real quick and then we'll do the yips after that. In you go. 
Cab s'mores can probably hang out for a bit. Let's see where we're heading next. Paying yourself a visit, yes indeed. Let's see. I would not mind getting ourselves a nice town event out of something here. And I think the ruins is a great way to level up some low-level guys, and we can bring the man-at-arms out again, finally. And the Antiquarian is actually in good enough shape to bring out for another run, so we'll keep her in the lineup here. I'll go for another Plague Doctor. Lord Rabbit gets in the mix. Let's go for the full Blight here. We can jail him, too, and then we'll get all Blight from these guys. Should work out pretty well. Mm-hmm. I think I'll give her the lunge too. In place of the shadow fade. So she can stay in those front ranks. And bop. And bop. Mm hmm. There we go. Check for you. I'm gonna go ahead and unlock those. We'll use them eventually, more than likely. And then I don't think his skills need upgrading at the moment. Let's do hit the blacksmith with these guys, though, for rank two. Yeah, it is nice to have at least a little bit of extra money, huh? Okay. Stagecoach check. Another anti-Q, but we're going to have to upgrade the coach to allow for more people, and that's probably not the wisest choice right now. So the next big upgrade, I suppose, then, is probably going to be... Oh, it's going to be rank 3 of the blacksmiths, actually. Yeah, for the weapons, definitely. So we've got to get some more deeds, hopefully. Maybe even reduce the cost of upgrades, too. Into the ruins again, though. Grab some blight trinkets for these guys. Right there. And then... Did we have another one, or did I sell it? Yeah, I must have sold it. Oh, well. Mm hmm. You can just have to dodge. Yeah, that's probably fine. Give the Arya box again. Quick draw charm might actually be better on you. And the man at arms has got the toy soldier. That's fun. More HP and dodge for him, and then more damage for you. Good. 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 Seems good. Seems good. Seems good. Oh my god, we can afford stuff. That's incredible. Oh, we don't need anti-venom in the ruins, though. What am I doing? There we go. No need for blood. Cool. Why do I... I think this is just a feeling that I get in this game at all times now. I'll never not feel like I'm forgetting something. That's just Didi in a nutshell, I guess. There is power in symbols. Collect the scattered scraps of faith and give comfort to the masses. I really like the the non-explore, non-cleanse missions. The things where you either have to Curious gather things or art, his efficacy um, unwitnessed by his own eyes. Like ex extinguishing the flames in the courtyard or whatever it is, like, you know, like specialty missions, especially the ones that give you town events, I like a lot. Alrighty, blight time. I also get that and usually am forgetting something. Yeah, no, I was gonna say it's usually true, which I suppose gives credence to the feeling. Credence Clearwater Revival of Darkest Dungeon. I have no stress heals again. I do keep forgetting that. And that's just as big of, of a priority as it's ever been. I should keep that in mind. Is the weapon that cuts on its own. Mm -hmm. White. You got a tiny bit of actual heals, but not a lot, yeah. 
we do have an abundance of blight and damage slowly gently this is how a life is taken and possibly for a an apprentice level mission that could be enough so far so good anyway it's a short mission yeah or no it's not oh yeah we have camping okay so yeah we'll probably be fine you forget about that their formation is broken maintain the offensive 60 stress on her already that was concerning but i'm sure we'll be fine remind yourself that overconfidence is a slow and insidious killer i need you not to do that oh never mind yeah you can have calm that's fine Doo -doo. It bothers me that it doesn't automatically use the torch light or the torch stack with the lowest amount, which is such a ridiculous complaint. But that is the reason I'm going to have to give it a 9 out of 10 instead of a 10. Unfortunately, that was the straw that broke the bear's back. It's a heavy freaking straw, dude. Thing made of titanium. Oh, sweet. There's one. In radiance, may we find victory. And I do not mind seeing them. Might be among the easiest boys we're going to be coming across here. Let's just go ahead and go for the big damage. Retribution here, maybe, too. This is just, this is warm-ups. Especially getting the blanket fires in there and being able to repost. God, repost is so much stronger in this one too, man. Bringing ears. The fact that it's uh, an amount of rounds instead of an amount of tokens is, golly, that is super helpful. I'm gonna be bringing this guy out more. Like that. Destroy them. All the all. the damage he's done from the repost alone just in this fight is insane. Oh right, and then I can do things like this. Which, you know, they're probably not gonna target her anyway, but still. I'm loving it. Alright, might need to camp soon for inventory space and stress of the plague doctor. As the fiend falls, a faint hope blossoms. A little bit worried about that. Prefer to catch it before her. Ooh. Wow. Confidence nice. surges as the enemy crumbles. Before her resolve check pops off. But may not be this necessary. expedition at least promises success. This is a holy water. Good stuff. A lot of money already. That feels pretty good. Yeah, there's a lot more multi-target skills in this game, that's true. Yeah, that's helpful like that, too. The strongest thing about repost in this game is the enemies on hit effects don't trigger if you kill them. Oh, yeah, sure. Man. Yeah, I need to be bringing out the man-at-arms more clearly. Also, ouch. That's not good. Ooh, love a scout, though. Could save us some trouble of having to go, having to go down that way. I might still do it. I think I will, actually, yeah. Let's see if maybe she's got a decent trap detect chance, and she does not. Mm. This is a stress healer? No, this is the quirk removal? Which, either way, on this is probably fine. This is the spot is unfortunate. I might just have her do it. All right, yeah, I know the stress heal. That's even better. Outstanding. Alright, that feels better now. See about some treasure. Hey guys. Ooh. Any misplay grenade is gonna hurt a lot. Light from that right now is ridiculous. Oh, big time dodge, hell yeah. Oh, that's not good. Wow! Watching it, Annie Q. 
Okay. Let's see here. Let's go for a little bit of... A bit of blight back there. I think I will retribution yet again. Good stuff. Right there, buddy. That's the one. That's the one. <laughs> okay. That was cute, guys. Please miss. Ah, oh, boy. Okay, yeah, that's bad. That's yeah, getting up there. Coral always makes you nervous. That's a scary skill. Yeah, there's a reason for that. That thing can hit hard. The slow death. Unforeseen. Unforgiving. That's why they're a top priority, too. That ought to do it. Press this advantage. Give them no quarter. I'm getting a little low here. I'm thinking I'm probably gonna camp out fairly soon anyway. A death by inches. Maybe I can sneak in a couple of heals. A couple of tiny ones. Uh, it doesn't really matter, but it might as well. Here's the damage if he gets his attack first. Healing on you. And let's go. Okay, that'll work. Success so clearly in view. Uh, or is it merely a trick of the light? Fuck. Hmm. I think I'm gonna let that go. The map is good. Come on, keep going, keep going, keep going. That's a quest location though, that's nice. Sadly did not find any of the other ones. I think I am gonna have to camp in this next room. This is a precautionary measure. It should be fine. It's a good time to do it. Circle in the dark. The battle may yet be won. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. No ambush prevention. We really should spend some time with the survivalist. Give myself some helpful camping skills here because we really don't have a lot of great stuff right now. We hardly have any stress relief, actually. I guess you can self-medicate. That's not of great. War can be healed, but never hidden. Pep talk, which is fine. Extra disease resist for her. All right. Not bad, I guess. Might get ambushed, though. The light. The promise of safety. Lucky duck. Okay. We have something for that. This grave robber is causing problems. Pylomania, apparently. The frustration there. Okay. I never resist going for the trinket lottery with the Q. I really should do that more. Yeah, there is the chance you get something really good with it, huh? Especially now, it's a good idea to get some early help. As the light gains purchase, spirits are lifted, and purpose is made clear. Three more torches. Hopefully get a scout here. No luck, okay. Need an executive call. That should be a stress heal. Or a buff. That works. Even the cold stone seems bent on preventing passage. Alright, one last one. Come on. Be right here for me. Crap. Alright, we know what to do. This is a stun. That's definitely a stun. Yeah. And then we gotta blight one at a time here. And I think actually after the Antiquarians one, that should be a kill for him. Ah, it would have been if she got first action probably, but... Maybe not now, but maybe actually? Nice. Alright, that's pretty good. I got to sit in on a panel with the founders of Red Hook at this year's GDC. It was an extremely interesting panel. That sounds awesome. Very excited for the Triple uh, I announcement. On the 10th. Looking forward to seeing what they're cooking up. Oh my goodness. Thank you, Pawn, for saving our asses here, huh? That's been nice. 
down. We got another antiquarian festering vapors coming up. Really nice to be the one using that and not having it used on me for a change. That's that's a heck of a relief. All right, man. No worries. Seize this momentum. Push on to the task's end. A little bit of cash. Keep it moving. Keep it moving. Oh, yikes. Crap. Well. Oh, no. Oh, God. That sucks. Nasty shuffle. Helpful. Okay. I'm getting a lot of dodge today. Jesus. No problem. Let's go with that. Go ahead and have him more Rampart, I think. Man. Extremely lucky. Alright, sadly she can't do anything besides move this turn. Should be able to get our double blank going now, though. Get a retribution up on this guy. Man, that shuffle did us in, huh? Sheesh. That was awful. I think I have a bandage for her, at least. not realize how fragile this was been sailing through these fights so far but now one little disadvantage and all of a sudden we're kind of struggling but there's the blight doing his job as is the retribution clearly go ahead and get a little blight started here okay okay I think we'll be all right. Battlefield medicine this as well. Just a little scary, but we're good. Oh, we're good. We're good to go. 17 damage crush with the retribution kill to finish it off. Let's go. The bigger the beast, the greater the glory. That's my boy right there, the man at arms. You love to see it. Off we go. No more torches. And the relic's gonna be at the very end, huh? A singular strike. Nice little blight crit there to start off. Let's go like that. It's gonna be him dead. Outstanding. Not a problem. Grandma, you're crushing it. Yeah, you've been very good him down. There we go. No more stress for Bear. Hell yeah. Love this team, too. I mean, distress seal when you just slaughter everything. Man. At arms. There's a reason you're my favorite, huh? Clearly. Mission accomplished. A little heal for the road. It's crazy. Eh, might as well. Be wary. Triumphant pride precipitates a dizzying fall. This has been an outstanding dungeon. This is the last three or so have been incredibly valuable. This is a bummer, obviously. Kind of makes me want to turn around, actually. Hold on. I bet we'll be better off. Let's do that. Because we're walking through already scouted halls. We're not going to lose too much torchlight. I'm pretty sure this is the right play. Yeah, just turn it around real quick here. Trap shouldn't be an issue. Now, who came in here and set that up again? Right after we left, there's just a sneaky little trap goblin showing up and resetting shit. You should be able to fight that guy. No more traps. The rest of the run. It was you? Oh, you little rascal. You little scamp. I can't stay mad at you. Alright. 
been through this hall anyway, I guess. Wealth beyond measure. Awarded to the brave and the foolhardy alike. Curious is the trap goblin's art. Plus two. One single point of torch light left. Not that we even needed it. Mission accomplished. Go team, go. The abbot will be grateful. The trappings of his faith have been restored. That's what we needed. Now, just all positive works. Good enough. There's our economy bolstered. Outstanding. Take advantage of this faith-fueled charity. All right. It will not last. I will indeed do so. Free healing here in the Abbey. Nice. Let's get everybody fixed up, huh? There you go. Now adulting. With the thousand bits, thank you. Bare minimum, I appreciate it very much. Let's do one more today. I think we can take on another boss. Oh, for a focus ring. I think so. Yeah. Ooh, or a legendary bracer. Ooh, baby. Love you. Have a good day. Those are very, very, very good trinkets. Those are among the best. I think we're going to have to push for one of these. I think it's probably going to be the Siren, actually. Get our first cove boss today as well. So that means Blight again. That means, in fact, we might just run it back. Although we did commit a couple of people from that squad, didn't we? We could do... A Shield Breaker would not be a bad idea. And then we could put the Grave Robber in third rank. A little more Blight from that. And then Abomination? Shield Breaker front. A Bomb. Grave Robber. And Plague Doctor. That's a fun squad. Oh, but she's rank three, right? Okay. And we committed the other one right, I believe. Yeah. She doesn't have that much stress. I don't have to commit her. Get out of there, Lord Rabbit. You don't need this. It's somebody else in there. Although there's not really anybody else that needs it. I guess I might as well for getting it for free. All right. There you go. There you go. Sick. That's a good team. That is one I can be happy with. Let's get them upgraded. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That's a good call, Booth. Thank you, yeah. I know I, I appreciate still reminders like that. I know I just went off on the back seaters, but yeah, it's helpful to be reminded of things that I said that I was going to do as well, I guess. It's a double-edged sword, man. I'm just trying to not make people scared to say stuff like that, mostly. That seems worth... Twice? That's a lot. Mm. We're probably not going to unlock too many anyway. Oh, shit. That's cool. I forgot that was a thing. She can grant armor piercing to all companions. Huh. Let's see. Psych up is pretty good. Bonus damage for him. I don't know if it's worth 1600 though. Gallows humor is a strong one. Yep, yep, yep. Of course, it is good to get three or uh, four instead of three skills since you can have four of them equipped. Um, let's go with leeches for the disease removal. I'm going to unlock psych up for him and then I think I'll go with encourage. It's good to have encourage on most people. Yeah, especially over pep talk. Let's do that. Okay, okay. How are we doing? Where'd that bounty hunter go? 
Erd. Oh, he's got commitment there. Okay. Um, and then Blacksmith was going to be rank three. We're not quite there yet. We need more deeds. Time for trinkets. The old process, baby. Let's go with the stun skill chance for you. That's fun. That venomous pile up front. Okay. Actually, you know what? Additional stun skill chance for you. I'll go for the blight skill chance for you. Grave Robber gets the crescendo. And I'm going to give you the quick draw charm? Sure. Sounds good. And then double box for the abomination. Oh, accuracy and range skills, actually. Hold on, yeah. I think I want that instead. Minus three speed after first round is kind of bad. But that amount of crit on the first round seems worth it. Time to go fishing, yes sir. A little bit more intense than our Stardew Valley fishing, but... Let's see what we can catch. Works for me. Let's do it. My lofty position wasn't always accompanied by the fear of office. And there was a time when I could walk the streets or raise a glass in the tavern without concern for molestation. Faithful as the tide, one precocious village waif made it her hobby to shadow my every errand. It was charming then. Troublesome later. I always wondered what became of the unfortunate little waif. Ah, that is an unfortunate layout. Yikes. Easy early fight, at least. All right. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Still top priority. Her damage output. I'm I'm kind of shocked, honestly. Like their formation is broken. Maintain the offensive. I think I've underrated the shield breaker. Grievous injury. Palpable fear. I gotta remember we've got Impale available to start some of these combats off as well, which might be worthwhile. Destroyed. Oh man, you know what? I might want to have Shadow Fade on this team, I'm now realizing. Although I guess he's fine in the third rank, isn't he? Yeah. We can start them with the. Oh man, there's gonna be a little bit of dancing going on. Well, that was easy. The okay. Slow death. Unforeseen. Unforgiving. Thank you. And we're gonna put on Shadow Fade and place a pick to the face. See how that goes for a little while. Yeah, Abomination's strangely flexible. If only treasure could staunch the flow of otherworldly corruption. I think he'd be primarily a front rank character, but does pretty well in rank three too. Let's go, dude. Early enough to hopefully be able to fit it in the inventory as well. Outstanding. Big money. Yum. All right. Oh, wow. Oh, yes. That's so good. Oh, man. Yay. 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 One of the best trinkets in the game. Dismiss head. Plus 25% damage. Plus 20 stress. Or plus 20% stress, too. But worth it. Absolutely worth it. That is awesome. I'm going to go ahead and give you the blight thing. Hang on to that for now. Real lucky day today. No kidding. Yeah, that is outstanding. I'm going to be bare leaning, dude. I'm ready. Double stun to start, man. It's too good. Too good to not do. And then we just go ahead and start lunging, or do we go ahead and go with a flashing daggers, a little greed, maybe? So we got the double stun already. Let's try to take advantage of that. We can get an impale going early on here. 
And then, how about a transform? Let's see what kind of damage potential we're rocking with this. A little extra stress is maybe worth it. Continue the onslaught. Destroy them all. Okay, okay. Barnacle Barrier is unfortunate, but I could double stun again, and I got a decent chance of hitting it on this guy, too. Slam is fun. Oh, that is excellent. That is really good. Especially when he heals her. It's going to mean only one chance for an incantation. If I kill this guy... Confidence surges as the enemy crumbles. There we go. That's effective. And then how about one of these? All right. Still had to deal with it, sadly. Let's finish you. A decisive pummeling. A little bit of that stress removed immediately. Fantastic. Shadow fade time. That works. My God, he has been really helping us out here. Get to transform down for a little absolution. A little stress heal across the board. Oh my goodness. A death by inches. What a crit there, too. Let's get him a nice big pierce to finish the job. Beautiful. These nightmarish creatures can be felled. They can be beaten. I don't remember what the curio is on that one. I think it might be holy water. I should try. Okay, another one of these. God damn, it's gonna be a lot of food, huh? Nice. Um, ooh, damn it. Anti venom. No. Yeah, anti venom. It's probably not necessary. Torch light already. All right, all right. Mm hmm. Start a blink. The impale again. Man. Hmm. I don't want to transform anymore. That's not a good idea. Although, sadly, I have to keep in mind if he moves up in the front rank, he's not actually to deal able to deal any damage. Can't get a pierce going here. I can get knocked back from that, actually. Yeah, okay, that works. That'll do. This is gonna be a play grenade. Another pale actually might do the job. Oh, that doesn't... I don't know why I thought that did blight. I guess there's no reason to have the blight thing on her then, right? Well, maybe I'll captivate, but I kind of doubt it. Needs a little more damage there as well. This dude's already really weak. Holy shit. Oh my goodness, we're getting so lucky today. Using up all my luck, slice and dice is going to go terribly clearly. I'm going to roll like garbage. Press this advantage. Give them no quarter. All right, might as well. Prodigious size alone does not dissuade the sharpened blade. That is a green trinket. I should probably try to keep it just to be able to sell it. I've already used the key for a secret room. I think that's probably smart to go ahead and dump that now. And then herbs are still worth hanging on to. I think I'll keep the citrine. Yeah, I'll just have to dump that, I guess. Okay, cool. I think that's a shovel. Oh, I've got an extra one. I might as well do that, yeah. Okay, this is going to be a truckload of damage. Let's see if maybe I can get a quick kill on one of these guys. The flashing still seems pretty good there, actually. That's going to nearly do it. We have the impale coming up again as well. Hopefully she's able to act fast enough. There we go. That was outstanding. Well, yet again, I have put him in the position to be up front. Slowly, gently. This is how a life is taken. And yet again, he acts first, unfortunately. Yeah, that's fine, I guess. Those two are dead already, though, right? Not quite. Let's go ahead and do that. As the fiend falls, a faint hope blossoms. This is worth. It. Ah, no. Hmm. Perched at the very precipice Ew. of oblivion. Damn it. 
like a mortality debuff. This expedition at least promises success. We gotta camp here. Yeah. I don't want to, but it feels pretty necessary. Is it? I don't think it is, actually. I lied. I'm not gonna do it. I'm gonna get greedy. I'm also gonna take the bus over to Citrine, I think. We'll see what this does. Well, shit. Alright. Do we have any camping skills that remove mortality debuffs? I don't think so. No. Unfortunately. I don't know if these guys even have any, actually. There's been a lot of food this run, man. Sheesh. Oh, no food. Never mind. Boy, this has been tough. Tough with the inventory this time, man. I think I just got to dump all that, too. It sucks. Hmm. I'm gonna Serpent Sway here. I'm try to kill the groupers first, actually. That's one down. No stun action, maybe? Ah, unfortunate. Definitely want to do that. Look at Shadow Fade coming up. That is really bad. That is the worst thing he could have done. Damn it. That helps. Even better. Okay, I think he can still do his stress wave there, so let's make him the top priority still. Hopefully this guy decides to target her. Okay, that helps. That's good. Land the blade, please. Got it. Excellent. Another stun coming in. Okay. Now, just the littlest bit of healing, maybe? Ah. My god. As victories mount, All right. so too will resistance. Fine, I'll take that, and then... Ah, Jesus. I get rid of the herb, but I got to. This is going poorly. Got a lot of combat so far, man. And oh, there's another one. Probably have some food. It's a good scout. That helps a lot. Have the other shovel for that, at least. Okay. Let's have her eat a quick little meal here. Same to you. And then there you go. Looking good. Not the worst team, I guess. Stun time. Oh, I forgot to move her, but that's probably fine. She might be better off in this position, actually. I'm gonna beast file that. That's two turn timer there to kill her. Impale looks good. That's two down. Shit. Nice. Bear, are there any mechanics from DD2 you'd add to DD1 and vice versa? Um, that's a good question. I. I can't decide if I like the token system more than I like the way things are in this game. I think I do, despite the fact that I've aired my preference for things like the leper not having blind tokens or the man at arms not having retribution tokens. But I do think that that system is better. It's, it's easier, it's more reliable, and it's easier to interpret. And I think that makes it better overall. Decimated. But I don't know if I want it in this game. I don't think I do. Be wary. Triumphant pride precipitates a dizzying fall. I think I like them both as they are in that respect. I wouldn't mind having visible turn order actually, London. Yeah, I was, I was thinking about saying that. I feel like I might prefer having that in this one. Eh, lost the herbs. Oh well. Mm hmm. No, don't do that. Why? Ah, lady. It's a precious bandage. Come on now. Hmm.
Another mariner. Another misfortune. I was trying to think still of like what else would maybe transfer. I think I prefer the um the navigation in DD2. Finding the stuff is only the first test. Now it must be carried home. But that's also still not one that I would like want to put in DD1 either. It's a difficult question because I don't think I want any transfer of mechanics. I think the way the DD1... I'm, I'm going to be real uh, diplomatic about it again. But no, I think the way that this game works is as intended. And I think the same is true of the sequel. A spark without kindling is a goal without hope. All right, got a lot of work to do here. No disease this time, at least. Not able to prevent the ambush either, unfortunately. I think it will take Psych up. And then immediately follow that up with the anger management. Six more. Let's go Gallows Humor. I don't know if it's worth it, actually. I'm going to try. Okay, that wasn't terrible. That's pretty good. We can give her another meal when we wake up as well. I think. Oh, it's snake time again. Oh, no, I didn't think about that. The light. The promise of safety. Oh, no, no, oh, no, it's not. It's, uh, it's veterans, right? I think we have to be veteran level for the next snake dream. So... Thank God for that. That could have sucked. And she can have this, right? Yeah, nice. I guess I should have waited for a hunger trigger, but... I also should have saved that torch that I used before the camp there. I don't know why I did that. Ancient oh, thanks. <laughs> lie in wait. Unsprung and thirsting for blood. Don't worry, Bear. We got you. All right, here we go. Last boss of the day. Let's do it. Siren time. The aquatic devils have remade the poor girl in their image. She is their queen and their slave. Pretty vulnerable to blight is this one, so we will very happily try to take advantage of that. Excellent. Great start. Man, anytime we can resist the allure of the siren song is an enormous benefit. Uh, you know what? Try a stun. See how it goes. Ooh, yikes. That helps. Ooh, resisted the blight, though, damn. Yeah, I think I just go all in on her. Don't you do it. Don't you do it, brother. Ah, son of a gun. Oh, no, buddy. Don't do that to us. Oh, boy. Okay. Fuck. Hmm. It is death's door for Q again. Becoming unwound. That's not great. Cool. Okay. Huh. Okay. Yeah, we're in trouble. That's a big loss. Hmm. I think it's three rounds. Oh, it's only two. Okay, that helps a lot at least. He's already transformed, which might actually help us out. Although I don't really want to... Oh, God. Position is really bad now. I guess I gotta do that.
Okay, that helps a lot. Slam opens up some options. Knock forward isn't bad either. Really just gotta hope we get another resistance here. Very stressed. IRL stress check. What's the play here? I think it's flashing, because he, he has enough blight, right? Yeah. And we can deal some damage that way. Ah, unless he friggin' dodges it! Man, that is really lucky. Okay, we got unlucky in the beginning, but we're getting some really nice breaks afterward. I'm gonna go for the Absolution, because I don't know if he can transform again. Yeah, he shouldn't be able to do that if she gets him again. So that should be really good. We have another Blight coming here. Sadly, it's gonna be on the guy that's already dying. That sucks. I believe we lunge. Okay, at least he's stuck in that form, and he's in the front, so he should only be able to Absolution. That's actually really good. That, that's just going to help me, I think. <laughs> so, yay. Got that, at least. Gal's got a type. Yeah, no kidding, huh? Really going after him. I appreciate that, brother. All right, there we go. Fix them up. Another Shadow Fade coming up. We hope to go to Plague Dr. Axe first, because, yeah, we're not, only, not able to do that. I just got to pass turn there, unfortunately. I have to allow for the Noxious Blast here. Alright, we're doing alright. One more Blight here, and I think we're okay. He's gonna have Solution again. And then he comes back, and he's in the front rank, I think, which means we should be able to do something... Ow. Oh, well. Crap. <sighs> yeah, I just gotta pass again. Fuck. Think about that. If I land this blight. Shit. Shit. Oh, wait. She's dead. Okay. Oh, man. Okay. okay. Lost the shield breaker, but we got the W. I guess I'll have to take it. That's a bear F for the shield breaker in the chat, though, man. That's unfortunate. But hey, the legendary bracer. I love that. All right. Another one bites the ethereal dust. Back across the sticks. Ooh. Open me down. So lucky. Well, so much for losing one. Who's it going to be, though? Wriggle's Lantern. Sweetgrass B3. Or Joe Gamer. Are any of those people here with us today? And would like for their characters to return to, to life? Calling all Wriggle's Lanterns Sweetgrass or Joe Gamers? Let's leave it to the to the rest of the pile then, I suppose. Who returns? Man in arms, leper, or jester? Do a quick little poll vote here. And while they're deciding that, I'll go ahead and say Thanks for watching, y'all. Another episode of the Darkest Dungeon Blood Moon campaign. Really appreciate the support on this over on YouTube. Please continue to leave likes on the videos. It does help a great deal. The YouTube algorithm loves to see those thumbs up, so please do so. Thank you very much for watching a new playthrough of DD1. Plenty more to come. Appreciate the support big time. That was a very even split between the leper and the jester here. Chat can't choose. Who's it going to be? Who's it going to be? 
looking like a jester. How many of each do we actually have? Sort by class real quick. We have the one man at arms and the one jester and then the one leper, right? I think we might actually have zero lepers. Yeah, that was our one leper and he died. Oh, Joe's here. Joe Gamer. You know what? I think you're the leper too, aren't you? Oh, no, you're the jester. But you know what? Yeah, Joe's here. Joe gets to come back. Welcome back, buddy. You will be laughing still at the end. Even won the poll. Perfect. There it is. All right. Thanks for watching, everybody. We'll see you in the next one.